So I made some of the mock pineapple zucchini. It is so delicious. Today, I'm going to make a bunch and freeze dry and see how that turns out. Let's go. You do wanna peel the zucchini first. I use a potato peeler because I find it the easiest. I'm just gonna chop it into, on these bigger ones, you need to get the middle part out. And I use a ice cream scoop and just scoop it out. Then I just cut it into slices that just, then just get cut into little chunks, like pineapple chunks. I already cut up zucchini. This is 16 cups is what we need for one batch. I'm going to put it into a saucepan. So I'm gonna add 46 ounces of pineapple juice to it. And three cups of sugar. Sounds a little chunky. We also need one and a half cups of lemon juice. So then I'm just going to bring this to a boil and let it cook for about 20 minutes to dissolve the sugar and soften the zucchini. Timer just went off, so I'm gonna turn off the heat. I'm gonna get these off the burner so they can cool down. I went ahead and transferred them to a bowl so I could use that pan for something else. I'm gonna, I need to let them cool down all the way. Okay, I'm gonna load up the harvester trays. This is scary trying to put it in here. Ah, this is like stuck to the pan. You So good. That is so, so good. Freeze drying for the win. Delicious. Now, we could also reconstitute it. We could pour it into whatever you want that we want to have pineapple in. But man, just eating it freeze dried is amazing. I'm sure how I'm going to get off the pan. That's the only negative. These actually came out super easy. Let me show you how we did it. Because it's like stuck in there. So, this is how it came out. Just turned the pan upside down. We kind of twisted it and it falls out. One recipe is about two and a half gallon Ziplocs of pineapple.